Sleeping prophet Edgar Cayce said in the first half of the 20th century, sound will be the medicine of the future. That future is now, as discoveries by today's scientists and sound researchers lead to the inevitable conclusion that consciously applied sound can be a healing and balancing element in our bodies and our lives. Vibrational healers, energy workers, sound therapists, musicians, and researchers seem just beginning to explore the powerful effects which healthy energy vibrations and tones can have on the human physical, emotional, mental, and spiritual bodies. Yet human beings have been using sound to access deeper states of consciousness, expand awareness, and heal the body for thousands of years. Chanting, toning, Tibetan singing bowls, Chinese meditation gongs, and mantras are a few examples. I've been studying and working with sound healing for nearly two decades, first through vocal toning, then through newer technologies such as my state-of-the-art sound vibration table and sound chair systems, and finally with my set of crystal singing bowls. The sound table and sound chair, designed by California chiropractor, musician, and researcher Dr. Jeffrey Thompson, are each equipped with specially designed low-frequency solid steel speakers, which Dr. Thompson says are comparable to electronic tuning forks attached to the hardwood underside of the table. When lying on the table or sitting in the zero-gravity reclining chair, the result is that of a padded tuning board. A person feels and becomes part of the sound vibration through direct bone and fluid conduction. When one adds the visual modulator light glasses, a flashing pattern of lights plays over closed eyes to the rhythm of the music, taking one further into a deeply relaxed state. It's a truly remarkable experience, as if the sound table and sound chair assist the body's cells in rewiring and reinvigorating themselves. Dr. Thompson says, Today, with highly sophisticated technological equipment, we can measure the changes that take place in the mind and body when sound vibrations are applied. He points out that technology now allows us to affect the body-mind in two ways. First, healing the body with physical resonance using sound frequency vibrations, and second, changing states of consciousness using sound with resonance of brain wave function. We can resonate with different parts of the body with sound for healing. Dr. Thompson continues, the obvious stress reduction benefits of listening to relaxing music have been proven through numerous research projects. The human voice itself is considered by many practitioners to be one of the most powerful healing forces in our world. Through toning, we can vibrate and stimulate our entire physical system. The sustained vocalization of individual pitches resonates deep into specific body areas. Studies show that sound enters our physical body directly before being processed by the brain, unlike vision, which must be filtered through the centers of the brain first before we react to it physically. This is why toning can be such a powerful therapeutic tool. Sound can give us immediate access to our emotions and a deep body knowing, bypassing the mind. Since our bodies are made up mostly of water and bone, when we begin to tone, the water within us picks up resonance and vibrates our bones. It's normal and relatively easy to learn to use our voices for healing. The voice is said to be the truest reflection of our inner health and well-being. It expresses the very essence of our nature. It is our life force, our breath with sound added to it. Our voices affect the cells and molecules of our body and can restore our innate harmony and perfection. I have a collection of 14 crystal bowls covering the range of the musical scale. Crystal bowls resonate within the body, bringing about deep relaxation and tension release and are said to have the power to create a positive shift in one's consciousness. As with many kinds of sound therapy, the bowls generate sound waves conducive to deep relaxation and healing. When one listens to the bowls, old stagnant energy may be freed up and released, making room for new chi or universal energy to flow into the body and energy field. Here's how the bowls work. Silica sand combined with water becomes quartz crystal. Quartz crystals have many physical properties. They amplify, transform, store, focus, and transfer energy. We see the results in microphones, radio, and television equipment, timepieces, laser tools, and computers, to name a few. Crystal bowls are made from 99.992% pure crushed quartz and heated to about 4,000 degrees in a centrifugal mold. 
They are available in clear frosted and colored bowls in a variety of sizes ranging from 6 to 24 inches in diameter. The bowls emit a powerful, pure resonance in the various notes of the music scale, said to correspond with the body's chakras or energy centers. One bowl by itself can be very powerful. When played together, the effect is magnified exponentially, the combination of tones providing a full range of sound which transports people on a crystal sound journey. As we've seen throughout this video, the human body is a great resonator. Our bodies, too, are crystalline in structure, composed of many crystallite substances. Bones, blood, and DNA are crystalline as well as the liquid crystal colloidal structure of the brain. Even on a molecular level, our cells contain silica, which balances our electromagnetic energies, and this is the same formula as natural quartz crystal. The body's natural affinity to quartz facilitates the pure tones in vibrating through us. Crystal vibrations may have profound effects on the organs, tissues, and cells, as well as the circulatory, endocrine, and metabolic systems. The bowls possess the same electromagnetic fields as exist in all life forms. Clear quartz integrates the balance of our own electromagnetic energies. When an organ or part of the body is vibrating out of tune or non-harmoniously, it's said to be in a state of dis-ease. A body is in a healthy state of being when each cell, each organ creates a resonance that is in harmony with the whole being. It may be said that perfect health would be a free flow of universal energy throughout the body. When one sets out to allow the vibrations of crystal bowls to do their healing, it seems very important to relax and form the intent to allow the vibrations to flow through the body. This is what I suggest to people at my crystal concerts, to relax and let go into a healing or transformative state. In the next segment featuring my set of large frosted bowls, you get a sense of what one may experience while listening to these marvelous bowls.